The PNGNA expressed their concerns this morning. General Secretary Gibson Sune questioned the process of vaccination. He questions the use of consent forms and the monitoring of patients after being vaccinated for possible reactions. Are they using us as a, as a, as a clinical trial? Or are they, if the vaccine is safe, I don't think we should be signing consent forms and we should be observed. We should just go and receive our vaccines. Why are we going through this process? The government and the national health department has to come out clear and inform the people. PNGNA is also concerned about the safety and effectiveness of the vaccine. Mr. Siunes says nurses should be educated about the vaccine so that they can manage their duties as frontline workers to address COVID-19 and more research and tests to be carried out by the Medical Research Institute on the vaccine to ensure its credibility. To be researched or tested by our, our Medical Research Institute in the country or to be tested by our NDOH quality testing. To do a proper educational awareness on these particular vaccines, especially to our health workers, so that we will now disseminate this information to the recipient, to the population now that yes, that vaccine is safe. PNGNA is also urging the Department of Health and the government to come clear about the information that is collected during the process of vaccination. If they are yes, signing, filling out consent forms, observation, definitely it will generate information. Where will this information end up? Will these informations go back to the manufacturer or will it become a property for the National Department of Health? Whatever happens in the country under health, information and statistics, research has to go through a committee to be certified, approved before it is disseminated. What will be the information management if they are collecting information on the implementation of vaccine? Gertrude Gabi, National MTV News.